Hi Karen, here's your feedback from this week's lesson. So we've got the before picture on the left hand side, the after video on the right hand side. So the things what you suggested from this week was what you wanted to improve was just to get rid of that slice on the top to the left. And um, originally we sort of had a chat and basically you said you needed that one swing thought um, as a trigger to make sure that ball flight was more in play, even if it did have that little bit of a fade on at the end or a little bit of a draw on. Um, the biggest thing was just to get rid of the slice because obviously it lost you a lot of distance, especially off the drives and the longer club. So one of the things that we can look at on this first picture is as we take the club away, although it is parallel to your feet line, what we actually want it to be is right on top of our toes. So you can see on this one how the club is outside the red line. We have a look at this after video now. All I sort of suggested was to try and keep the arms really close to your chest on the way back. Um, and feel as though the club's swinging round the body a little bit more. So if we have a look at this one as we take the club away now, can you see how the arms are definitely kind of a lot closer to your chest on the way back? Um, and the yellow line is nearly directly over the red line. So as a result, on the way back down, you have got a lovely shoulder turn to the top, but on, as a result on the way back down, you can see how the club stays a lot closer to your body at this point. Whereas on the before picture on the left hand side, everything works quite steeply and this causes quite sort of large divots or and the swing path coming over the top. Um, even miss hitting it to the left can be straight left. Or if the swing path continues over the top of the club face is open, you also get kind of the idea of a, a slice off to the right hand side. So where we are on this after picture, I'll just draw on the green line now. You can see how the club's working sort of a lot squarer down over our yellow, over our red. And as it goes through, it's going to go a lot straighter through to the target, um, to the target and continue.